Why not, man? Yeah, man. Why not? Got Jax in the box getting on the mic. Okay, boys. It's another wonderful Tuesday night here in Gainesville, Florida. Indeed, indeed. So, fun fun stuff. Uh, we got Squall from Jacksonville from Ohio. That's how I'm going to say it. From Jacksonville from Ohio. Okay, so anyways, uh, they actually played. This match actually happened in Jacksonville Re Revival on Saturday. Uh, Squall took it 2-1. Wow. Yeah, but it's just going to be a little bit different. It's first to three. And, uh, it's, this is this is a best out of five. It should be. Huh? This this so it was first to three before, but it's, it's best out of five this time, right? Yeah, because it says okay. winners finals, right? Right. Oh, finals. Dang, dang already. Okay. Um. So gotcha. the the thing here is that Nikali, uh, according to Gamer B, this is Nikali's worst match. Really? Box, yeah, boxer. But Squall displays really good knowledge in this matchup. Yeah. So uh, Squall. Definitely knows how to play this matchup. He I mean, beat, he's showing it right here. Yeah, yeah. He's he, game one. Yeah, he beat Lord Float, uh, and then he beat beat Cam fair and square. <laughs> Nikali fair and square. But anyways, back to the match. So, Cam is the uh, Moondog is the advantage, putting him in the corner, but Nikali pushed him out just like that. Both these characters have really good corner pressure, um, especially with Nikali that has a super brings you to the quarter automatically. Uh, well, definitely. I mean, both players... Indeed, as well, are both very aggressive, especially when they put the oh, other in the corner. Exactly, and Cam uh, doesn't like to hold down back as much. Uh, he likes to play aggressive. He likes to be in your face. He wants that stun bar. He wants to try to get you with tap. Now, time to guess. Plus frames. Nope. Big combo. Super. Yep. He's gonna oh, go out. Yeah. Ball opening him up. Opening him up. Yep. That should be the game, right? Should be it. Nope. He gets a setup here. Pixel of life. Yep. Oh. Yeah. Plus frames. And press the button. So, um, in, 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 well, not in V-Trigger, Nikali's critical art has, he doesn't really get a setup, but in, in, uh, when he's in V-Trigger, he does get a, a setup. That's so true. Cam had a guess, and uh, he guessed right, but he just uh, pressed some buttons afterwards. Oh, wow, what a whip punish there with a crouching pierce to get whatever button Nikali uh, threw out there. Yeah, Moondagi opening up with the first yep. blood. So far, so good. Yes, and so... I like Squall's game. He's not getting intimidated by what Balrog has uh, to offer. Wow, another whip punish there by uh, Moondoggy. Oh, the press counter. Yeah, this is going to be a lot of damage. Wow, that's probably about... 35? Yeah, yeah, 35% right there. Yep. Just like that damn, uh, damn near even game. Yeah, and uh, Nikali is very, very scary in V-Trigger. He gets a lot of fast movement. His moves are faster. I think more damage in the frame data changes a little bit, too. Yeah, dashes are very fast. Hard to yes, react to. Oh, wow. Anteer's the dive kick. Oh, the f just nearly sent me out of that, but oh, gets punished for it. Oh, oh, no kill there. Oh, gets grabbed. So here's the, here's the Oh, he's in the corner. Yep, that's going to be super. Oh, my goodness. Now, here's the thing. I don't know if Moondoggy should have used his V-Trigger because he, he could have used those for V-reversals later on. Yeah. He goes to kill him. Yeah, the cancel didn't do anything. But anyways, uh, that's okay. We're getting a game too. Yeah, he's a little bit flustered right now. Oh, what? Heavy kick, minus four. Oh, yeah, he, man, he's <laughs> he's just throwing him out there. Yeah, I mean, there's a soccer match on TV here and uh, <laughs> right here as well. All these kicks going on. Looking like Real Madrid right now. Like, yeah, is that what's going on? <laughs> uh, so Moondog is going to change his approach here. Oh, tries to go for Shimmy, but. Uh, Squall did not take the bait. I like to see him punish kind of out of these anti-airs. Yes. Oh, the press Yeah, yeah he, he didn't get much off there. It's hard to get off. Oh, this is going to be big damage. Oh, he, only, oh, he doesn't go for as much. Yeah. He doesn't go for as much. Oh, oh, oh he's going to he's gonna die here. Yeah, he's dead. He's dead. What? Yeah. Just, just like that? Yeah, so... 1-0 score. I think maybe Cameron sh should have went for a little bit more damage there uh, when he popped the V-Trigger. He just went for two swings, and I think he tried to have, I think he was trying to bait an EXDP. Yeah. But Squall showed some really good patience there. So Moondoggy has much of a hill to climb, uh, much higher than the one in the background here because he's asked to win three games in a row now. So that means he's got to show a huge difference in gameplay. And so far, um, 
Wall still has his number. Yeah, there you see it. Pushing him in the corner already. Yeah, and it, this is... Man, and the rabbits are stunned. The, yep. Almost dead. This should be almost dead. Or He's dead. Yeah, wow. Wow. Yeah. Uh, I keep forgetting how much damage EX uh, Berserker Barrage Slash does there. Um, so, yeah. And Doug, you know, it looks like he's just respecting those heavy kicks a lot in the corner. Yeah, yeah. And, you know, Squall is playing a lot different than he did on Saturday. So, he's thought about his matchup. Oh, he definitely has. Yep. And he's playing at max range distance, which is not the best of McCallie. But he's making it work. And here's the dive kick. So, doesn't get anything out of it. So, I kick. think one of the things Moondog has to do is play a bit more patient and make Squall have to come to him. Because basically Cam has been delivering him damage by just going forward. Yeah, so maybe uh, if, if he can keep up with that gameplay. But, I mean, it shows Squall has been showing that he's been able to be very adaptive in his gameplay. Yep. Oh, indeed, you're seeing it here. Now he's seeing it a full bar meter. Yes. And the heavy kick is minus, I think, four, I believe. So he doesn't get advantage. But Moondog is just respecting it. Because you still have that many in the here. Yeah, uh, and well, the thing is, Moondog used to play in the Before Balrog came out, he was in the Cali That's player. right. That's yeah, so right. he should know, right? I don't know. It's maybe he's a little messy. We'll yeah, see. I, I we're just respecting the player himself. So. Yep, and I don't know what it is with Balrog players playing the Cali before the character came out. I don't know. Yep, this should kill. Oh my goodness, is that okay. heavy kick, man. Just keeps running into it. Oh, this is uh, Ultra. Uh, wow. Wow. 3 0 Grand Finals. Yes, yeah, uh, Squall advances to Grand Finals there. And uh, it looks like I'm going to play my match against Shin Man here. Uh, anyways, that was a very good match. Um